Hello everyone, it's so good to be with you and we're going to have a nurturing time today. Uh, having just completed our Embrace Your Life as a Sacred Creation wonderful immersion together, I am feeling blessed and honored to be a part of that with so many and I want to give you a piece of that that has been um, very helpful and very meaningful and it's a great, oh, it's just a great way for you to nourish what it is you want to create. So here we go. Well, let's get right to it because you're ready. I know you are. So imagine that there is, just imagine some thing that you want to create. We've talked for years about manifesting, but you know I love to use the word creation because it starts from the inside. Think of something that in your heart you long to create, to give meaning and value to, to put yourself behind. Is that a, uh, maybe it's a new puppy, <laughs> who knows what it is for you. All right, maybe it's a great new business. Maybe it's a new way to make pasta. I don't know, just be creative. What is it for you right now? It all matters, it all matters, okay? So imagine this is something that you want to create and you see how valuable your life is. Starting point in your heart, that you see how valuable your life is. Can you do that? I'm going to tell you that your life is so valuable. It doesn't matter how much chaos is going on in the outer world of resolution and trying to keep love out of our hearts and trying to put down and take away everything that uh, matters in the world of love and in the world of connection. There's a lot of that going on trying to stamp that out. Don't be taken advantage of by emotionally getting caught in that so-called creation, okay? It is not. It's destruction. But boy, we can get so distracted in running down the ro ro uh, road after the distraction. It's like, don't go there. Just really focus on what, super focused on what you want to create. Come home to that. Know that there are tons of us doing it, okay? So, Consider that thing that you want to create. And when I say thing, you know it's a quality of experience that you're wanting to create. A quality of experience. If you were going to create a baby, even if you're a guy, you know that if your partner wants to create a baby, even if it's a gay couple, there's something you have to bring forward of creation to do that. You have to hold it sacred. You have to hold it valuable. This matters to us. Now, for the woman that's pregnant, she's feeling that in her body. This matters. This coming forth really matters to me. So you're going to right now feel pregnant with what matters to you. A job interview? What is it? A way of being in the world you've never been before, more confident, more abundant, whatever it is, I want to help you feel pregnant with that. So what you're going to do is uh, imagine a picture of that, what that would look like if you were abundant, if you got the job, in the job, um, if you found um, uh, a new healer to work with, if you found a remedy for a physical challenge you've had, whatever it is, feel what that would feel like in your abdomen, that you're pregnant with it, that you're going to be bringing it to birth, to fulfillment, to fruition. So hold it there. So just take a moment, put this on pause if you'd like to, or replay it again if you just want to hear it first to get the instructions. Feel that as though it is a living being growing, creating within you. That it's real. Okay? Intimate partnership. Maybe it is a baby you want. 
feel that in your abdomen. And if you have parts of your abdomen that are going, Bleh, I don't want to do that, just say, that's what we're doing right now. We're going to make space and move the bus by, <laughs> the block, whatever you want to call it, away and just go, we're going to make a little space. Even if it's a starting space, it's small. We're going to make a little space for this to cre creation to grow through and in. And it may be small to start with, pinhole even, but as you put attention on it and just keep putting your hand on your belly throughout the week and just saying, hi, I'm here for you. You matter to me. You are so important. You are so valuable. This creation that I want to bring forward, guess what starts to happen? It starts to grow within you. And it's the law of the universe that you will magnetize to you what you have moving within you. And the old patterns, I'm going to sneeze, which means there's an old pattern that we're collectively moving out. We're not going to have to do the sneeze. We're just going to move it out. Oh, here it comes. Ready? <gasps> there it goes. Yay. <laughs> What's ever in the way of you creating in fullness from what you long to create? Bye-bye. It's gone. So that you can make space in that abdomen of yours to be pregnant with the creation that has meaning and value for you now. Okay, great. All right, try that on. Please enjoy it, live with it. Please write in the comment section below your experience, how that worked for you. It's so exciting. And let me know if you have any questions. All right, I'm here with you to support you in all your creations, all your creations. And in the United States, we're moving into the 4th of July, so let those fireworks that you see on TV or in life or in yourself be fireworks supporting what it is that you want to create. All right, so that the whole United States is your divine cheerleader celebrating life moving in you in the way that it is valuable to you. Okay, celebration for you. Time to do that. All right, much love to you. Enjoy it all. And feel free to visit my website to see what other goodies that the wisdom of my guides and I have to bring to you and the openings and the love for sure. Okay, with you completely. Bye.